Change default code page of Windows Console to UTF-8. Currently I'm running Windows 7 x 64 and usually I want all console tools to work with UTF-8 rather than with default code page 850. Running, CHCP 65001, in the command prompt prior to use of any tools helps but is there any way to set is as default code page. Update. Changing hiki underscore local underscore machine backslash system backslash current control set backslash control backslash nls backslash code page backslash mcp value to 65001 appear to make the system unable to boot in my case. Proposed change of he underscore local underscore machine backslash software backslash Microsoft backslash command processor backslash autorun 2 at CHCP 65001, Newell, served just well for my purpose. Thanks to Ol underscore Broom. To change the code page for the console only, do the following. Start, run, reget it. Go to key underscore local underscore machine backslash software backslash microsoft backslash command processor backslash odd run change the value to at chcp 65001 Mule. if odd run is not present you can add a new string Personally, I don't like changing the registry. This can cause a lot of problems. I created a batch file. I saved at C column backslash windows backslash system 32 as switch.bat and created a link for sendd.x on the desktop. In the properties of the sendd shortcut, change the destination to C column backslash windows backslash system 32 backslash send dot x slash k switch. Voila, when I need to type in UTF-8, I use this link. In the 1809 build of Windows 10 I've managed to permanently solve this by going to the systems, language settings, selecting, Administrative language settings, clicking, change system locale dot dot dot, and checking the, beta column use Unicode UTF-8 for worldwide language support, box and then restarting my PC. This way it applies to all applications, even those ones that I don't start from a command prompt. Which was necessary for me, since I was trying to edit org the code from Atom. Edit the registry. Then restart. With this fix, if you are using Consola's font, it seems to lock PowerShell into a small font size. Sendy.x still works fine. As a workaround, you can use Lucida Console, or I switched to Cascadia Mono. This URL